were here at Lake Chilba, which serves us as a proto lake of uh, the African Rift Lakes system. System, mm -hmm. and um, we have this lake. It's a very tiny baby lake, and um, this is perfect for us because uh, we think that in the north of Malawi, in the Chewondo Beds, we have also a prototype of Lake Malawi. Mm. So we take this environment here as a proxy for what we found in uh, northern Malawi. Mm -hmm. But one of the unique things about our project is that by coming here and, and investigating this proto-lake situation, it would be useful for us to understand something very much more sophisticated about the environment of the Chwanda beds of 2.5, 3 million years ago in uh, what is now northern Malawi. And by doing that, we want to, to perform uh, metabolic ecology, the first actual, actualist experiment that's ever been done in a real environment, which is to, to sample a variety of things here in the environment to understand where all of the resources are, all of the elements of the, the chemical periodic table, where are they? Because these elements are being taken up by animals and plants, they are excreted back into the environment in certain proportions, and all of that activity, the, 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 the growth of animals and plants and their releasing of of these um, elements back into the environment, them being taken up differentially, deposited into the lake, into the, into the foliage here, etc., is a way of describing the metabolism of this place, the energy flow inside of it. That's completely unique. And if we can then understand this environment in that sophisticated a way, we can translate that information to the Chwanda beds up in the north and for the first time do the metabolic ecology of a fossil locality. And we will have a much better understanding of what happened in the Chibondo beds and how the environment was shaped by them. Yeah, yeah. So to do that, to uh, get the metabolic rate out of this environment, uh -huh. we will sample everything living in and around this lake. We did a little pilot study here and for this we sampled the environment basically. We did some water sampling from the water and the catchment rivers and we also um, sampled animals already mm. like snails, bivalves, we sampled a monkey, we sampled several mice, mm -hmm. uh, we also have uh, tree trunks that we sampled which is nice because it can show us directly how old the like tree the is for example. Rings. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I think in the future we should expand our sampling to um, more sampling of the water, especially mm. when we have dry season versus wet season, so we can also establish the history of Lake Chilba. Yeah. Uh -huh. So we can have a timeline of deposits right. from the lake. Yeah. I believe that no one has ever even performed an actualistic metabolic ecology in any environment. So what we're doing, we're doing two things at the same time. We're actually helping to develop the field of metabolic ecology and at the same time applying it to the fossil record. Yes. Yeah. <laughs>